should guess. All right, are you are you ready? Oh yeah. yeah. Okay. So hi, it's Carlos here again. Uh, as promised, it's after six, so we thought we should do another one. This time I'm not alone. There are um, resident, I, as I wrote in the details for the video, resident opposition, specifically people over pipelines, and we have the media here as well, Ben from. Uh, I'm sorry. WBNC. From WNBC, WBNC, WBNC News for Burlington County. Um, so yeah, we're in Chesterfield, and we're in between two parts of this compressor station. Over here is where the actual compressor station is going to be built. And as my video earlier today, there was actually a lot of activity going on, showing that the construction is ongoing, even though the pipeline hasn't been passed. So they're just assuming that it's a done deal. Uh, maybe, like I said, some winks and some nods, just build the thing, we'll get, push it through, people have no power to stop you, that kind of deal that we're all getting too used to with corporate and uh, government collusion, not on our behalf. This doesn't benefit New Jersey, the other pipelines is, doesn't benefit New Jersey, um, but here it is. So the compressor station's over here, and over here is the electric, um, the way it's going to be powered. I actually can't see it, there's trees here, but on the other side of the tree line, there's further down there's a turnpike, but as you can, there's a lot of power lines here, so that's how they're going to power it. Um, maybe at, towards the end we'll get to walk, walk over that way. Um, so, yeah, so we're going to walk down to the actual mouth of the driveway, not to necessarily stir up controversy, but maybe um, it's possible a guard will come out or somebody that's still working will come out. Most of them have gone home for the day. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna just go that way, I guess, was the idea. So we'll follow through, let you get more of a view. Come on, come on. <laughs> and I guess while we're walking, um, I'll, I'll point this out now. This road, this is where the pipeline starts, and it's gonna go down this road quite a ways, maybe a few miles, and then a turn here, turn there. Eventually it'll go 30 miles to the end in Manchester. I am following that route. I decided, it's a little bit radical, but these are sort of more radical times, so we have to do things a little different. Um, 12 a.m. tonight, I'm gonna start walking, and I'm gonna be walking until sunrise, and then I think, be careful. 